Hey everyone, this is John from Quick Tips, and today I'm going to be showing you how to factor trinomials the easy way. First thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to multiply the first number by the last number, and the product you get is 48. And you're going to want to write that off to the side. The next step is you're going to want to find all the multiples of the 48 and create a list. <coughs> Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to look at the second sign in your problem, which is the plus right there. And what you're going to want to do is, since that's a plus, you're going to want to make the, find two numbers in this list that are going to add to 19, which is the second number. So if you look at the list, you'll figure out that the only two that add to uh, 19 are going to be these two right here. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to drop down the 6 by itself. And then you're going to want to factor normally with the rest. So you uh, you write your x and your x for the x squared. Then out of these two, you're going to want to, first you're going to want to look at this sign right here. The first one. And uh, basically that's going to tell you, okay, out of these two numbers, the bigger number is going to get this sign. So in this case, it's going to be the 16, so plus 16. Then since obviously this is a plus, this has to be a plus 2. So I mean, if this was a negative, then you'd put a negative here. And it always it always goes with the bigger number. So you got your x plus 3, and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get rid of the 6, so you're going to have to divide both of these by 6. and then all you have to do all the rest you have to do is uh, basically essentially you're gonna subtract the x and then since that x is negative you're gonna have to switch the sign so basically if you just look at it you can tell that you, all you have to do is just bring the x down and switch the sign so basically you, you get something that looks like that and then what you're gonna want to do is just simplify these and there you go, there's your answer.